Out there, give you something to run after. Leo's collegiate first day score record is 46 40. So you're gonna have to run something close to, yeah, just, just to run under 49 seconds. 48 97 will give him that. Well, good start for Leo, and you know, he's experienced enough to know that if you wanna run a good time, you've got to challenge yourself early. There you see him, he's got a solid lead right now, but Camper who doesn't have as good a 400 meter PR time. He's doing a great job there in the middle of the track as well. Josh Farmer of UCI also doing a good job. Leo now lifting into the finishing state. Compre trying to stay with him, but it's gonna be Leo Neugebauer. Oh, Compre finds a gear. Finally finishes just behind Leo, 48.01. So that is well below what he needed to get that first day score record. 48.03 now it's corrected to. 4,685 points on the first day. That's an improvement on his record by, or on Garland, Kyle Garland's record by 25 points. So he had something to shoot for, Dan. Well, nice move by Josh Farmer there with about 200 to 150 meters to go, but it's just a bigger, stronger, more powerful Leo Neugebauer down the stretch, but good run for Edgar Camper as well, who ran a personal best there. He did find another gear, and this is where you learn how to really challenge yourself in meets like this, and Leo crosses the line, and he's like, you know, that effort's a good enough e effort that I can throw up the throw up the horns here on that finish. I th he would have loved, I'm sure, to have seen something in the 47s, but he's just right outside. when we started this evening, but still not necessarily ideal. And it is the 10th event of the two days for him. But it's a matter of what does he want to do? Does he have any ambition to really go after it? Let's tell you what he's got to do. If he wants to score 9,000 points, he needs to run 438.38. Certainly within his capability, but does he want to do it? For 8,900 points, 454.72. And if he just wants to break his own collegiate record, of 8,836 points. He just needs to run 5.05.67. I'm betting on something in that 89.25 area, personally. 
Well, that would, that, would, that would surpass my score. I would move down to eighth all time. He would move up to probably sixth all time. But I'd love to see him score 9,000 points. Just think about that as an NCAA record, 9,000 points. But talking to Jim Garnham, I said, what are you guys going to do? And he said, we're going to go for it. Man, we are here to score big. You don't squander an opportunity when you have an opportunity to score really big. But what Leo Neugebauer has done in this competition, he's sending notice. Look out, Pierce LePage. Look out, Kevin Mayer. Look out, look out anybody else in the world who thinks they're going to get a medal at the Olympic Games. All right, so that's the Leo Neugebauer story. But there yes. is a team story going on here, and Arkansas this is always a big event for them, and they are right in the hunt for some decent point totals if things go well in this 1500. All right, the leader there on that first lap goes 68. Leo 73.5, so that he's in that he's in that 440 range. But here we see the, there we see the leader. But that's Yario Soto Torado of Arkansas. He sits in 10th place right now. He is an outstanding 1500 meter runner. He needs to move up. He needs to move up at less than 100 points to get into eighth position to score some points. Jack Turner, the other Arkansas athlete, there's Jack with the shades on. The Brit there for Arkansas, he's in fifth place. He's a good 1,500 meter runner as well. So Arkansas, again, in the multi-events, has an opportunity to score good points. And more importantly, how they do is really on them. They've got to go for and try to match or exceed their personal bets, and that will move them up significantly on the leaderboard, especially Soto Torado. So this is interesting. There's a lot of guys out there on the track, and normally you don't run with this many guys on the track, and Leo is with a pack there towards the end. And if this pack wants to help him at all, they've got to pick it up just a little bit. The guys up front are running pretty well. There you see Toronto in second. Jack Turner now moving up from sixth or seventh place into sixth position. It looks like he's going to make a run at the leaders as well with just over a lap and a half left to go. 210 at the half for Leo. No, that's 220, not 210. 220. So if he splits that in half, he's got what he needs to be just under 9,000 points. 230, I should say. So I think I'm looking, my estimate is looking pretty good, actually. Okay, now you see Leo Neugebauer coming to, coming to focus. He's ahead of that final pack. It looks like he's got to get his chin down a little bit, but it looks like he's making a little bit of a move. He's making an effort to pick that pace up as Yario Soto Toronto and Jack Turner make a run for the front here. Arkansas there third and fourth as Yario Soto Torado now making a bit of a move. He has run 427, and Jack Turner has run 430. So they can race themselves up the leaderboard and help out their Razorback team. And that's O'Connor from UConn out front. He and Yario Soto Torado are battling it out. Torado did not have the best meet, but he's still in the hunt to go to the European Championships. As we get to 100 meters to go, it is, this is going to be a great kick to the finish for those two up front. And Jack Turner in third, he's going to solidify himself in this 1,500 meters in third place. Toronto's going to come away with an event victory. That's Scott Boone of Houston, or no, that, excuse me, from UConn. Toronto goes under 430, Jack Turner as well. But keep a look at the back of the pack. Here we go, 437. Leo Neugebauer is going to come through in under 445. And we'll see what his score is. Well, it's a collegiate record for sure, because he only had to run 505 for that. Needed to run 454 for 8900. So I'm liking my 8925 prediction a whole lot. 89.61, that's a crazy number. What does it mean to you, 89.61 in your last collegiate deck? Man, it's it's unbelievable. I can't even describe doing that here at this meet. Um, having so much fun being also my last decathlon here in college. 
Uh, but I can put my words, uh, my thoughts into words right now. Okay, can you put your thoughts into words of like, I was so close to 9,000. Uh, it was it was cool playing with that idea. Uh -huh. It wasn't supposed to happen today. I really tried. I passed people. It's the first time ever that I passed everybody, anyone in the 15. So I tried. It wasn't enough. But there's other events where I can definitely get the points. I want to talk about sort of your growth as an athlete in your time at Texas. Your first deck, 76-21, and now you're nearly 9,000. What has this four years been like to go from that number to the number you put up today? It's been a crazy way, just like my progression. It's been like a slow process, especially in the last two years. I really put in a lot of work, a lot of literally every single day because all the um, championships and everything is just rented. You know what I mean? You have to earn it every single day. And that's what I did. Yesterday, you were a little worried you didn't eat enough. What went into the body today? Take me through. Oh, my God. I ate a lot. Minimum double of what I ate yesterday. Right? Yeah. Any Uncrustables? Because, like, Lara's up there, and she can, she can house, like, eight of those. Not Uncrustables, but in all, a lot of granola bars and sandwiches. Finally, you got a couple of months to get ready for Paris. Your thoughts early here on the Olympic Games? I feel great. We'll go back to work in, like, a week or two, so I'm excited. It's been a great four years. A pleasure watching you. Congratulations. Yeah, it's been a lot of fun. Leo Nygabauer, uh, the champion in the decathlon, collegiate record holder. Dwight? All right, John, what a great career he had. 1,340-point improvement over his first score at those Texas relays when he was a freshman. That's amazing. And again, he has upside potential in several events.